Hello everybody. This is Yoko Cinnamon Reactions. And let's see if I can finish this review today. My blind reaction to Ruby Volume 7 Episode 11 will start in 3, 2, 1. Okay, I know I don't need to be really pausing it yet. I just thought of something yesterday, well, after I had watched uh, episodes 8, 9, and 10. During that last, the televised thing between Robin and Ironwood, telling everybody about Salem, she was using her, uh, essentially her lie detector semblance. He said that the communication tower was finished while he was holding her hand right he lied and yet it didn't show him lying it showed apparently he was telling the truth so why is that how was he somehow telling the truth when apparently he wasn't when he wasn't i don't know let me know in the comments Nineteen, what? Is he counting or is Ironwood counting? Ooh. <clears throat> Careful, Ironwood. Jerk, we've got control of the battlefield. Come on, Iron One. Kick his butt, please! I think he's counting. Oh, shit. I don't want to know when he gets to zero. Yes! <laughs> yeah, take his weapon away first before you try it oh fuck I don't want to know what he gets to happen when he gets to 10 and gets to 0 I mean I love the music come on Ironwood don't let this guy win Behind you! <laughs> Shit. Oh, you almost had him. Come 
Come on, Ironwood, please win! I don't want to see the bad guys win! Yeah, no. Genius, James. You just stood atop it and called yourself a giant. I gave you everything you could have wanted. You chose that fat imbecile over me. Imbecile? You mean the guy who made Penny? Who created a freaking girl with a, a robot with a soul? Well, he used his own soul for that. In this instance, my brains and your brawn are evenly matched. You're smart, but you're not the only one who can count. Huh? Oh, I know. Shit. That was a little too close for my liking, James. Rebuilding those rings is going to be such a pain. Isn't he uh, metallic? A now, bit? If you'll excuse me. Can he just pull his hand out? I, I wouldn't do that if I were you. I mean, unless you're hoping to add more metal to that body of yours. Oh, so it's not metal. Okay. All right, now. I heard one. Come on. What? Jesus! How far was his hand in there? Oh, you're gonna drop him? You gonna drop him? I will sacrifice whatever it takes to stop her. <laughs> oh, I hope you do, James. I hope you do. Is he gonna drop him? Fellows, you're under arrest. <coughs> <laughs> Come on, guys. Crow versus Tor Crow versus. Ugh. Crow versus this guy, Brown, too. Come on. Be careful, Crow. Remember what happened last time you fought this guy? You got poisoned. I just love how <laughs> it's a three on one fight. Come on, kick his butt. No. Yeah, no poison for you. Yes! I love how she made it ricochet. I love it. This guy is completely and utterly insane. Oh, definitely. Okay, that's. Oh, exploding winds. Baby. Yeah, no. Yeah, thank you. Where's that smile now? <laughs> yeah, he deserved it. Requesting prisoner transport. I really wouldn't. I'd I'd get rid of him, to be honest. We have Tyrion Callos in custody. Did he drop him? No. What? What's wrong? Ironwood, what's wrong? Yes, sir. Was anyone caught trying to enter the school grounds while I was away? N no. Are you sure? Still a He knew. Now show me where you've been hiding her. 
Penny, be careful. Affirmative. I don't understand. Why would the general call us back without giving a reason? Especially with evacuation still going on in Mantle. You don't He's got a to reason. understand orders, kids. You just have to follow them. Civi transports won't be stopping anytime soon. The general says he needs us now. He needs us now. You all get to the general and find out what's happening. We'll bring Oscar and see you soon. Be careful, guys. General Ironwood? We have made a critical error. The Black Queen was the symbol Salem showed us before we lost everything. Her way of telling us she was inside. That it was too late. We stopped Watts. We stopped Kalos, but someone was here. They put this in my office to tell me that it... What if Mantle was just a distraction? What if it was just to draw us away from the Academy to... to... Sir, it's going to be okay. We've got Mantle can't on the keep... side now and... How do we know that wasn't part of their plan? How do we know they didn't want us to bring people into Atlas by the thousands? In trying to save everyone... We left ourselves most vulnerable. Salem has been one step ahead of us this entire time. What was in the bag? It's glass. Black glass. This was Cinder. She's alive? Yeah. And she's here? If Cinder's here, then... For all we know, Hazel's here too. Sir, this isn't over yet. As far as we know, Hazel's not here. It's not over till it's over. Don't Are be counting everything me? out yet. Sir? How did Robin know about the Global Communications Project? I have no idea. Oh, wait. We told her. The night of the ambush. You did what? We were trying to help. By going behind Something's her in the bag. Wait. Does that mean you let her escape? Robin is on our side. She always has been. We didn't know that. Guys, there's something in the bag. Right now. Loyalty always matters. Shh, I knew something. The brave huntsman and this is not good guys. Congratulations. We stopped Tyrion too. And we'll stop Cinder and anyone else you try to send here. Dear girl, their goal was never victory. It was merely to set the stage. For what? For me. I am scared, Time guys. Isn't on your side, James. It's always been on mine. The people She can outlast any of y'all. Suffered enough. Surrender the staff and the lamp to me, and they needn't suffer any further. That's not going to happen. I thought for a second he was going to say that's all you want. Simply accept the futility of your situation. And this can all be over. <laughs> I highly doubt that. Capable of. The lamp showed us. It showed us everything. Yeah, it showed us what you are and all about the gods. We've seen that you can't be killed. But we've also seen you fail. <laughs> we don't have to kill you to stop you. And we will stop you. <laughs> Dang, Ruby is so freaking confident and calm. I wonder what's gonna happen next. Your mother said those words to me. What? 
Wait, why didn't your mother have a run-in with Salem? She was wrong too. <laughs> Ruby, you okay? Yeah, but yeah, when did when did her mother have a run in with Salem? That's Salem? Yes. That's who we're up against? Uh huh. She's apparently on her way. But we'd be alerted if any forces had approached the kingdom. We have long range proximity alarms all along the coast and. They're offline. With all of the chaos, we didn't notice. Watts must have shut them down. Or they've already been destroyed. in your speech that Amity Tower was ready to launch. Was that true? I'm guessing no. You just said that. To lure out Watts. He did. General Ironwood? I've sent your sister to claim the power of the Winter Maiden. <gasps> what? When I realized we'd been compromised, I knew we couldn't wait any longer. The staff in the lab have to be locked away. I thought... you said we could keep it. Well, that was before you lied to me about the lamp. Before you lied to us about Robin, before Salem was right on our doorstep. Before Mantle was nearly destroyed, and myself and my army were left exhausted! The timeline has changed, and so we must change accordingly. What are our orders, sir? We are going to take our plan for Amity Tower and apply it to the city of Atlas. What? Huh? It was Oz's plan in a former life, but he didn't take it far enough. If huh? we harness the power of the staff and raise ourselves high into the atmosphere, the city's artificial climate will keep citizens and food supplies unharmed. Always out of reach of whatever Salem may try to send our way. You do realize that the Grim can no fly. Finished evacuating everyone. You'd be leaving Mantle to die. Yes, I would. We can't allow Salem to capture the relics. This is our best chance at getting the staff, the lamp, and the maiden as far away from her as possible. But. We have an opportunity to reunite the world. If we launch the tower, we can all work together again. We could even call for help. If we can hold out long enough. Sometimes doing the right thing means making tough decisions. You're right. And I think the right thing to do would be to stand our ground. Me too. Me too. Me too. I don't know if they're going to listen. We ran ourselves ragged, trying to save Mantle tonight. We tried that again against an even larger force- But you're huntsmen and huntresses! You can't just back down from a fight! You can't focus on one single fight while trying to win a war. What's the council going to say? Nothing. Once I declare martial law. No. Oh, what about Robin? Who exactly are you loyal to? We're loyal to the people counting on us to save them! We are saving who we can. Guys, I don't really know what to say in all this. Do you think he's right? Do you think he's wrong? It's John. We've got a serious problem. I was declaring martial law and abandoning Mantle. Salem is coming and he's going to use the staff to move Atlas. If we don't stop him, Mantle's going to be just... I'm sorry it's come to this, but until Atlas and the relics are safe, you are all under arrest. Ray, let you take us. <sighs> I know. 
You guys might want to leave. Find the others. And try to figure out what the freak to do next. Ruby, are you there? Nope. Ruby. Did you tell them? Oscar. Where are you? I hope he's okay. He didn't get a chance to tell anybody. Ruby had to get that out quick. And even then, she didn't get the whole message out. This is not good, guys. Things have gotten worse. Do you guys think Ironwood is right? Do you think he's wrong? Who do you think is right in this situation? I know it's a tough decision to make. And I think it's essentially... Do the needs of the few outweigh the needs of everybody, essentially. Yeah, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Let me know in the comments, please. Hello, everybody. This is Yoko of My Reactions, and... This is gonna be my review. No, not my review. No, no, no. We haven't gotten even got the reaction done. My blind reaction to Ruby Volume Seven, Episode Twelve. We got one more, and then the, we got this one in the finale for season for Volume Seven. My blind reaction will start in three, two, one. Mm-hmm. We cannot let him do this! Miss Hill, I'm sure the General understands the enormity of this. Great! Clover? Crow, you should know that I've been asked to bring you in. <laughs> oh, shut up, Tyrion. And a show. There's also an alert out for Team Ruby's arrest. What? Has James lost his mind? He's trying to stop anybody who might get in the way of this inhumane plan. Looks like he underestimated me. Again. Only Crow is under arrest. After everything we've been through tonight, please don't make me arrest you too. Cut it out! Both of you. We're almost back to Atlas. Let's talk to James personally. It's taking a very long time for this show to get to the good part. Shut up. Yeah, right. shut up. Let's get this over with. Robin? <laughs> you wanted to talk- How'd you come to this? He doesn't have to. You can hug it out once we've taken him down. Great. <laughs> Oh, great! This guy's gonna get away! What are you doing? The will of our goddess! Yeah, get out, 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 out! Weiss, what did you do? The general is leaving Mantle to perish? 
He's saving Remnant. We can't let the relics fall to Salem. But all those people we just protected, they won't survive. We don't have time to- That doesn't bother you? You have to- it's either between what's what right and what you think is right. Our friends! My personal feelings don't matter. We have orders. I'm to retrieve the power of the Winter Maiden so we can access the relic. You're here to ensure my safety. Now come on. We've already lost enough time. Maybe if you guys hurry, you can stop matter. it. Penny, the general is making hard choices so we don't have to. For the good of all, not just a few. I do not see what is good about any of this. On that we can agree. At least you agree. Please, think about what you're doing. You heard the general. Until this is sorted out, you're under arrest. Really? Please, don't make this difficult. Don't make us have to get out of here by force. <sighs> whoa, whoa, whoa. We're not actually going to slug this out, are we? If it comes to it, they might. They decide what happens next. You think you're going to stop us? <laughs> We're the best huntsmen in Atlas. You were. Then you trained us. <laughs> you were, and then you trained us. Yeah, definitely. Run, Ruby. Come on, Harriet. We're playing right into Salem's hands. You know we need to be working together. Oh, don't give me that crap. I had you kids pegged right from the start. How? Do you not want to work together here? Hello? I'm guessing you don't know about her semblance, that she doesn't feel pain, and that she uses it to power up. If you come peacefully, we won't hurt you. Speak for yourself! They betrayed us! You're betraying the people you've sworn to protect! <laughs> It's not worth it, Blake. They're just following orders now. Yeah, are you mindless order followers? Or do you have brains of your own? I know you sneeze are used to getting what you want, but it's time to let this one go. Yeah, nope. Not listening. This is my home. And I'm not giving it up without a fight. Yeah. You guys okay in there? <laughs> oh shit. You okay? Robin needs help. Surrender, and we can take her to Atlas. Get her patched up. Are you insane? I've never pegged you for the manipulative type, but I've learned a lot of things tonight. I enjoyed working with you, you know? Even with that endless cynicism of yours. I'm usually proven right. <laughs> we don't have to fight, friend. <laughs> you don't know my friends. That's how it always goes. <sighs> <sighs> Are you out cold, Tyrion? Or are you just sitting there listening to everything? Eh, yeah, you're just listening. <laughs> Ow! Sound like it hurt! Ooh! Ouch! He likes pain or what? But that was freaky. Ooh. Oh, like bad luck versus good luck. Who's gonna win? Oh, don't stop on my account. Uh, wasn't planning on it. God dang it, man! Calm down. Take this guy down. Oh, he's just watching. <laughs> he's just watching. Oh, now we get to see a fight. <laughs> Me and 
you have a score to sell. Oh yeah. I agree. So what say we put the kid to bed and then finish it? Really, a fishing pole? Why would you have a fishing pole? Wow, those two working, somewhat working together. Who would have thought? I never would have seen that coming. Marrow, cut the crap, will you? I'm trying to arrest her, not kill her hair. You're being excessive. Agreed. It's not excessive if it's necessary. Ooh, Blake, you okay? Time to wrap this up, Vine. They've had their chance. Don't be soft. Are you telling me? Or yourself? <laughs> <laughs> Teamwork, I love it. <laughs> nice. Well, one down. I love it when the music pops in because then things get good. Oh, yeah, pay attention to your own fight. You can't focus on both of them at the same time. Yeah, no. I love those guys. Yeah, nope. Thank you. Out. We have to stop Ironwood. If you can't access the relic, he can't move Atlas. We just have to get to the Winter Maiden. Blake and I will look for the others. But our scrolls don't. Huh? Oh, good. What did you get here? This is the part where they ask us to help. Yeah. Oscar must be around here. Maybe. Oscar! 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 You're here! No! Huh? That's not her! Thank you! <laughs> this crazy girl showed up and attacked me. But she looks like someone else. Neapolitan. You know her? We haven't exactly heard good things. I hope it will okay. be for her. You said your personal feelings do not matter. They won't change my actions. What I'm committed to. The power of the Winter Maiden and the Relic must be kept from our enemies. Even if it means she dies. But, yes, Penny. We must still acknowledge our personal feelings. Wrestle with them. It ensures us that we're on the right path. Mm hmm because if you don't have good if you don't have a, you're not in, if you don't have control of your emotions you're I think I understand dang it's right if you're not in touch with your emotions is what I was trying to say then you're essentially like a sociopath or something what was that oh this is not good
Oh no. of Ironwood's puppets. Lucky. Mm. Cinder, you were responsible for Beacon. For what happened to me. It was, unfortunately, temporary. Now step aside or there won't be anything left to salvage this time. Mm. What do you think of that? I think... It gives me personal feelings. Oh man, I still can't believe these two are somewhat temporarily teaming up. If only to take this top this guy from interfering. Did he push it forward? Oh my god, I still can't believe these guys were working somewhat working together. Why couldn't you just do the right thing? Instead of the thing you were told! Yeah, have a brain of your own! The right decision is the hardest to make. I trust James with my life. I wanted to trust you. <gasps> Okay, you're definitely gonna die. No, no, no. Don't you fucking die. You were too good a character! Does it look like your friend's gonna make it? I'll kill you! Oh, you mean like you just killed Clover? <laughs> he did use your weapon. Ah, here they come. Right on time. Oh, fuck you, Tyrion. Ah! Oh, it looks like our score will have to wait. You know my track record with the authorities. <laughs> Ignore him for now. Go help him. Someone had to take the fall. James will take the fall. I'll make sure of it. <laughs> Good luck. God damn it, why did you have to die? Why couldn't you just knock you out? But then again, that guy's a serial murderer, so. Freaking Robin's been unconscious the whole dang time. She's gonna probably think he killed him. No, actually, no. No, her semblance. She could tell if he was lying. All she has to do is use her semblance on him. She'd be able to prove he's innocent right then and there with her semblance, because it shows whether you're lying or not, right? What to do when you're lying? Because we've seen it grow green. When you're telling the truth. So what happens when you lie? Does it glow red or something? She'd be able to prove. She's a freaking walking, talking lie detector. As long as she survives, Crow has a good shot. Anyway, we got one more, one more episode. Oh my god, I can't believe that guy died. I was really hoping that guy would see reason and team up with them. But no, Tyrion had to go and give in to his stupid killer instincts. Anyway, I'll get to work on everything and I'll see you guys next time. Hello everybody, this is Yoko's Anime Reactions and I... Uh, last episode of Volume 7, guys. We're at the finale. After this, we've only got Volume 8, the fairy tales, the soundtrack, and the rest of Ruby Chibi. That's all we've got left for Ruby. And... Till they do the 
Anime? Anime? My blind reaction to Ruby Volume 7 finale, or episode 13 if you want to get technical, will start in 3, 2, 1. Oh my god, come on, no one else die! So the Winter Maiden's gonna have to die in order to pass on her power, so something's gonna happen with that. I just don't know what or when. Cause she ain't no spring chicken from what I've heard. Give up. We've got you outnumbered. All right, then. If you can get rid of that umbrella, you might have a chance. Oh, well, shit. Be careful, Oscar! Yeah, no. Yeah, no. What? What the? Where'd she go? Freeze! We gotta move. Be careful, guys. I'm scared. <laughs> be careful, you two. We don't need to be else die. We don't need we're dying. You think hoarding power means you'll have it forever, but it just makes the rest of us hungrier. And I refuse to starve. And you do realize that you won't have that power forever because you will die eventually. And then what are you gonna do? That power will be gone. You won't have it anymore. You won't have it after death. She's not good, guys. I'm scared. I have come too far to be stopped by some toy. Toy? That's an insult. What am I saying? She intended it as an insult. These guys stop her. Winter, you okay? Hmm. Ooh. What are you doing? My life doesn't matter. I disagree. Uh, hurry! We gotta lose them. Oscar's trying. Oh shit.
I'm scared, guys. Wait, where'd they go? Guys? They went this way! Oh shit. No, don't be bold! Stop. Yeah, that wasn't her! Good guys. You had your time in the sun. But now I'm afraid your time is up. Yes. I've been waiting here. For some time, I think. What was I waiting for? Oh shit. Me. No. No. I had a job to do. <laughs> she might be old, but she still ain't gonna let you take it. Nope. Yeah, no. With age comes experience and wisdom. Something you do not have. The Witter Maiden. That's the power of a fully realized maiden. It's too cold. We have to do something. Penny, are you crazy? I'm oh. sorry. Don't be. We weren't ready to become huntsmen. That's not true. Then why aren't we holding the relic? Now Salem has the lamp, Ironwood has the staff, and we have nothing! Red, that's enough. Hello? Anybody there? Can you hear me? Our scrolls? Doctor! <laughs> Finest mind in Atlas! <laughs> what are you doing? Grabbing our getaway ship. We need to hightail it out of here. Where are you? The academy training room. We slipped away from some soldiers, but it won't be long before the- ah! They're here! We're on our way. Just stick together! This is not good. Oscar! I'm sorry, but you all need to go on without me. Heck no! There's something I have to do alone. Are you insane? I probably hope that Osborne comes in and saves her butt. What are you gonna do, Penny? Are you okay? I had a job to do. I was supposed to protect the power of the maiden until I was ready. I worry I may have lost track of time. Maybe a little bit. You can tell Jane. That I'm ready. Now. Ma'am, if you do that, I'll be gone. Mm-hmm. She knows. I, know I have a hard time remembering. She knows that I much. Remember that. It'll be okay. What's your name? Penny? It's Penny, ma'am. 
<laughs> Penny. Are you the one? That should be Witter. I... What are you going to say? There's the door. Winter, thank you. I know that must have been difficult. I... I'm so sorry. Uh, that's not Winter. Oh, thank goodness, I thought that was- I thought that was Cinder or something. Thank god, I'd rather have been- Whom do I have the pleasure of speaking with? Oscar or Austin? Still just me. It was smart of you not to bring the lamp down here. I wouldn't trust me either, right now. Trust is what I'm hoping to fix. I know we can still figure this out. All of it. Together. Please. Do you intend to fight me? No. That's exactly what she wants. I guess it's because of us, but... Holding it helps calm me down when I'm afraid. You still think I'm afraid? We all are. I mean, who wouldn't be? In our fear that reveals That's easy for you to say! You can label me whatever you'd like. But the fact of the matter is, I was right! The minute I softened, let my guard down, that's when Salem had her opening. If you abandon Mantle, you abandon our best chance of reuniting the world. You abandon Remnant, leaving millions to fend for themselves so a few can survive. What kind All of- All excellent philosophical points that won't matter if Salem wins. Listen to me! No, you listen. I am done letting others' inability to see the big- If you would let Oscar talk, maybe you would, would see his point. Rob. The council, this kingdom, even you. And you're as dangerous as she is, James. James, to my friends call me. To you, it's general. Are you serious? Ozpin, you better take control or this is not going to go well. Hurry! Hurry! Say yes! She's mine! No! Hurry! No. Stop, Cinder! Winter! Can he do something? Oh, Ospin, we need you now. Oscar. No, this is not good, guys. Penny. <laughs> ha! She took the power from you! What are you doing? What's that? What was that? The single quality that is common across every living creature on this planet is fear. Of course. Wait, what did Oscar do? Winter! What did you do? It's funny then. 
that as common as fear is, we so easily underestimate its power. It was her, it was her time. What happened? She's gone. No. She's a part of you now. Fear of growing close to someone. A subsequent fear of loss. Fear of failure. So what happened with Oscar? Where's he at? Where's Oscar? That's what I want to know. And as more people depend on you, those fears can take on greater power. At least she is, is somewhat believable on you. Good God! At least someone believes you. But fear she knows you wouldn't kill the guy. Concern. You'd probably knock him out. Would he kill him? Oh, there he is. It is who we become while in its clutches. I suggest you all surrender and comply with the general's orders. We can't do that. Then I suggest you run. No, you're hurt. I'm not going to leave you like this. You're not leaving me. I'm giving you a head start. This is special operative Shni in need of immediate medical assistance. Go. Send reinforcements. Okay. She's telling you to go. She'll get medical attention. Carve out our own way. We need to go. It'll be okay, Weiss. Come on, Penny. Go. Will you be proud of that person? But where is Oscar? Will you forgive them? Will you understand why they felt the need to do the things they did? No. Will you even recognize them? Or will the person staring back at you be the very thing you should have feared from the start? Yeah, you didn't do what you planned. I suppose. Oh, he survived. Find out okay. Sooner or later. Oscar. Memories. You're back, aren't you? You saved me. Actually, you saved us. <laughs> but where are you at? Oscar, I... Stop. All I want to know is how we save Atlas next. That's all we need to know right now. Where the heck is he in all that? What? Oh yeah, the whole Salem thing. <sighs> Great. Great! Salem wasn't lying when she's showing up. Great. <sighs> now we got this to deal with. They ain't getting a break, can they? Great, so this is how it's going to end. Sorry, I can't really talk about anything. I'll see you guys next time.